calling Skyblock. Um, as you can see over there, well, two things. I set up a shop area, which I will show off once we make it over there. And also, I changed my skin because I was kind of getting bored of the other one. Um, I didn't think the colors were bright enough, so I made this little, uh, little thing. I also, I have elf ears, but you can't really see them. Um, but I think it's cute. Um, and I don't know, I was getting really bored of the old skin. But yeah, um, we have, I, I made a shop. I made two shops, one with all the stuff that we need and then another one which is like a pop-up shop which I really love the way I did this um essentially I'm going to have it uh not necessarily change every episode but change every time we uh, how do I explain this so every time we buy from it it will change so if I want to buy something from it I have to buy it if I want to buy two things, I have to buy them all in the same episode, otherwise in the next episode, um, it will have changed, and, um, the way I've done that is, it's all random stuff, it's basically random stuff, all for only one stack of wood, so, no matter what it is, it's only for a stack of wood, and, um, the way I've done what items pop up in it is I've gotten a random number generator and generated a random tab in creative and then and then a random um like this a random row and then a random number in the row and whatever that thing is that's what's being sold at the shop and every time we buy from it uh, it gets reset in the next episode, or if we don't want to buy any of it, we can just uh, say, okay, don't want any of that, and then it'll be reset in the next episode. Um, the other place has just all the stuff that I think that I might need to buy or want to buy, um, like dirt and saplings, uh, as, as well as, um, or that includes saplings of uh, of different trees, but it's all, like, pretty expensive to buy, um, and when I say a stack of wood, by the way, I mean logs, um, so we're gonna need to grind a lot of wood, um, and the other thing, too, is that, uh, we're also, yeah, we're gonna need a lot of wood to get the dirt, which we're, we're we need the dirt to, grow more trees, but we can't get the dirt until we have enough trees, so it's a whole thing. Um, oh, I have made a mistake. Let me see if I can get three cobble from this thing for a new pickaxe. One, two, three. Okay, cool. Oh no, why? That's so rude. Um, So we want to build out this way, um, so that we can actually access the shops. Ah. Okay. I'm really, um, I might change the prices, but I think they're all, like, I feel like I went to the extreme with all of the prices because, um, uh, because I didn't like a shop isn't normal in skyblock so i didn't want to make it really easy so a lot of things are kind of absurd prices which would be hard to get now but i think once we've gotten a good uh like tree farm i guess once we've gotten a good tree farm we should be fine the hardest thing to get is going to be a, like a lot of cobble um which is one of the things you can buy with uh just because like, if I'm buying saplings, I'm probably doing it because I'm out of wood, in which case, like, I don't want to have to, like, I don't want to lock myself out of that, uh, right, so, you buy the saplings and wood with cobblestone, I've done 
wanted to so you can buy cobblestone with wood and buy wood with cobblestone because um, I thought that might be that might make things easier um, okay we're just gonna need a lot of cobblestone to get over there I think I can't remember how many stacks of wood it was for um, for dirt was a lot. Um, I'm also like selling other stuff so um, selling like iron ore and diamonds and stuff like that but um, once you what the hell once you get to the more expensive stuff like diamonds you're buying it with uh, iron rather than rather than wood or cobblestone. So I think it's fair. I've also got some different, um, different mob eggs that you have to buy with iron, I believe. I don't think anything's, uh, nothing's bought with diamond because I figured that's just too expensive. But, um, there are diamonds there. I am really excited about the pop-up shop though. I think that's a really fun, really fun. Come here, because I think I would like some string, honestly. Thank you. Um, I just think it's really fun. Okay. Let's keep going out this way, and I think I will... I'll keep doing it as too wide, because we're gonna... Um, I think I've decided that I'm only allowed to trade if the path is too wide to the whole place. So I could go there with the one wide, but um, wouldn't be allowed to trade anything. Although we don't have anything to trade anyway. So it doesn't really matter. We don't have enough, um, what's it called? We don't have enough cobble or wood to buy anything. I think the cheapest thing that you can buy with wood is a stack. Um, so, doesn't really, can't really buy anything. We're really just working towards the dirt. I'm hoping, I, I think I made the dirt two stacks of wood for 32 dirt, which is kind of absurd, but I'm also Again, I want it to be really hard. I don't want it to be easy in any way because I already feel bad for doing it at all. I do think it's a fun idea, but I still feel bad for doing it. Um, I don't really like not, you know, when you have a challenge like this, I always want to do it in the way it's intended, otherwise it doesn't feel challenging, you know? But, um, this time I think we can make an exception because I have no dirt anymore, so I think it's fine. I really, I think I'm going to, um, do this because it's getting crazy <laughs> at this point. Um, and now things shouldn't fall in there as often because things were mainly falling in through the top. I really don't get it. I'm so annoyed. I just feel like sometimes your luck is just really bad. I know there's a specific way you can look to where the blocks almost always go a specific way, but it doesn't work, really. <laughs> okay, I'm also gonna quickly turn around. Oh two trees. I'm going to get these because once we do get there, we're going to want to buy stuff. I think we're working towards the dirt first because I think the quicker we can get a lot of dirt, the quicker we can get a lot of wood, right? Um, which I think is what we really, really need is a lot of wood to buy other stuff. I can't even really remember what what's in it. I did it a couple days ago. Um, I remember some things. Like, there's, um, an, 
exchange rate for cobblestone and wood where you can buy, I think is it a stack of wood for half a stack of cobblestone and a stack of cobblestone for half a stack of wood, I can't really remember, I think it was something like that. Um, but I think, I think it's all fair, I don't really think that any of them are equivalent to each other, right? But, um, I don't know, I wanted it to be hard, because we're, we're only going to really use this as a last resort, or for things that we literally couldn't get any other way. The cobblestone to wood thing, and the wood to cobblestone thing was just because I was like, oh, that would probably be a good idea to have. Um, okay, we're getting closer, and the villagers are still spawned in, that's good. The only rule of that island is that I'm not allowed to actually trade with the villagers. I don't think that's going to be a problem, because they're all fishermen, except the wandering trader. It's obviously a wandering trader. But, um, yeah, that's the rule for that island. No trading with the villagers. Um, but we can, you know, buy it from the shops. Um, I just kind of wanted to put villagers there for fun. <laughs> some stuff away. I don't want to drop everything again. Um, we're getting very close though. For the wandering shop, I was kind of thinking of doing it, um, changing per episode no matter what, but I figured that's not a very good idea because I do need a stack of wood per item, right? So it's going to take a while to get that. It could take like a couple episodes to get that. Um, probably not a couple episodes, but you know what I mean? Like, if I'm buying other stuff and then I see something cool in the pop-up shop, I'm probably not going to be able to get it that episode, and then at that point, I think it defeats the purpose of having it at all, if I can only do it per episode. Um, so I think, uh, once I've bought from it, it will leave the next episode. Is, uh, good enough, um, good enough idea. And then we can just say, no, we don't want any of this, and um, it'll just go in that episode and come back in the next. Honestly, it is really fun, because it really is just a lot of random stuff. I know I have, right now, I remember one thing, and it is um, some sort of potion, I think a healing potion. Just like really random stuff <laughs> that I don't think is ever going to be useful in this series, but also it's fun, right? Like I could get anything in that shop, which I think is the fun of it. Um, okay. Let's get over here. I'm also probably going to get rid of the parkour jumps. I just thought they kind of looked cool, but I don't know about... Because I did fall a couple times in creative, so... I don't even think we're at, we have enough cobblestone right now to get there. Which is annoying. No, we don't. Oh my god. Okay. Well, we could jump there, but um, genuinely do not trust it. Oh yeah, we sell lava as well and stuff like that. Because um, I figure I can get that stuff to go to the nether. Um, and at some point we gonna have to have as well a, a shop that sells the, probably, you know what, let's not do that, let's, well, I don't know, a shop that sells the um, end portal frames would probably be cool to, you know, have it so that we really have to work to get to the end, but we're gonna have to really work to get to the end anyway, so. Maybe it's just better to put the portal out there somewhere and we have to go and get to it. I don't know. Okay. We are so close. I'm gonna get 24. 24 bits and then we'll go. Um, or maybe 32. 
decisive. Okay, there we go. 24. Oh, the rain's gone finally. I always hate when when the rain shows up in Minecraft just because I know once it goes it will feel so quiet. <laughs> it, it, like it really really does feel so quiet out of nowhere. It's weird. It bothers me. <laughs> see selling a mob which I, I vaguely remembered that we ended up with a mob spawning but I couldn't remember which one okay so this is the shop um, so we've got two stacks of cobble for one single oak sapling that's a bit much one stack of wood for 16 seeds two stacks of cobble for 32 logs four stacks of wood for any one of these saplings, or if we're going with these, any four, because you need four to make them. Uh, one stack of wood for 32 dirt. Okay, we can do that in this episode. 16 saplings for two iron ore, two stacks of wood for half a stack of cobble, uh, 32 wood for two gravel, 32 iron for two diamonds, and I'm doing these in ore blocks just in case we, just in case we ever get fortune i don't think we will but you know four stacks of wood for any one of these villagers cats dogs tropical fish and one axolotl uh, 16 iron for a lava bucket a water bucket or just a bucket eight iron for two gold and we read through all those already so everything's kind of really really expensive but i think it's fine um, the one stack of wood for half a stack of thing is actually pretty good, um, and we can do it in this episode too, so that's nice. Go, 
so, oh, it's a slime block, okay, so stack of wood for a splash potion of healing, a stack of wood for a trade, two trader llama sponics, a stack of wood for shears, a stack of wood for 16 slime blocks, can I just test something, okay, so that would, you would get slime balls out of that. I don't know that any of those are entirely worth it. The trader llamas might be. Well, not for a stack of wood, but that's kind of the, the way this goes. You can get an insane deal. Like a stack of wood for, I don't know, what would be worth a stack of wood? That would be insane. Not sure. Oh, they keep losing their jobs, that's really funny. Right, let me go get the rest of my wood, and we're going to buy that dirt, um, and start planting some more trees. Uh, so we do, we need a lot of wood. As much wood as we can get. Um, I might go ahead and say now that I don't really want anything from shop. You know what might be fun is me doing that in in video. I'm gonna do that at the end of the video. We'll replace what's in that shop. Um, and I guess anytime we replace what's in the pop-up shop, we can do it at the end of a video just to show you that I'm not cheating. Um, and also it is just really fun to slowly see what we get. Um, okay. Uh, what am I doing? I need an axe. That's what I'm doing. Uh, and I think we can start eating bread now. Uh, okay, put that away. Right, we're very close to having a stack of wood. There you um, Let's get a stone axe. So we 
So, an iron axe. Okay. one.